I really was a lot more negative than that. What's good guys, it's your boy Siobhan here back with a new video and today I'm going to run through 10 of my top favorite silly tweaks for this week. They're looking very awesome right now and the first one I have for you guys is called Spring Plus. So if you guys remember Spring to Minus 3, this is basically its little brother. It's replacing Spring to Minus 3 now. So if you don't have a Spring to Minus 3 upgrade, this is the best one for you. It's called Spring Plus. You can change a lot of things. Everything on your springboard can be changed from your docks straight up to your status bar on your lock screen You can change a lot of things you can change system wide UI such as enable black keyboard enable key borders remove dictation key Disable breadcrumb no search bar blur no screenshot flash it, a lot of things can be changed You can also change stuff in the phone application hide a favorite tab you can change up stuff in the cameras, you can change up stuff in the settings, like hide the separators, hide the icons, you can change stuff in the app store such as hide trending, and a lot of things can be changed to definitely check this one out, it's called Spring Plus. Next up guys, we have CC Wall Customizer, and this lets you set a background for the control center, you can configure the tweak in settings also, and just enable it in settings, you can pick the image, and then the tweak takes care of everything, it even auto spring so you don't have to worry about a free spring as of right now noctis and dark mode tweaks aren't supported noctis work i should say but when you enable dark mode it removes the wallpaper if not check it out it's a very good tweak it's called cc wall customer next up on this jailbreak list guys we have this one that's called tiny siri you need a custom repo that is down below in the description and as you can see on my right we have the iphone 7 on jailbroken and that's how your Siri looks but with tiny Siri it customizes Siri into a smaller banner style you can either put the banner at the top of your screen or the bottom and it's just like Mac OS Sierra it looks very sleek and nice so definitely check out tiny Siri if you use Siri a lot next up on this jailbreak list guys we have this one that is called low power mother and this lets you set a custom battery percentage to turn on low power mode and basically how you use it is that you set your custom battery percentage to turn on low power mode in settings the default is 50 percent and also you can disable while charging the default is i think 80 percent so you could change that to like 98 95 or change the custom percentage when it turns off you can just change that around it's very good if you like always trying to save battery and you don't want to turn off low power mode while you're charging so definitely check out low power mother next up guys we have apex 2 this was a paid application before but it's now free inside of Cydia and it brings a fun way to organize and access your related applications so it's very easy to use it helps you like save home screen space and get rid of excesses folder clutter by just tucking away all those related apps in a discrete way behind another application so the way how it works is that you simply swipe up on any app icon to beautifully fan out its slots and you can select like sub apps so if you swipe up and hit the plus it'll ask you like it'll suggest related applications that you could use and for example you can place multiple camera or photo editing apps behind your main camera app of choice and you can also configure all the settings in the settings panel for this one it's called apex 2 but the downside about this one is that if you use iWidgets on your home screen, you cannot use Apex 2 and iWidgets in one. You can only choose one or the other. But if I could use two, I'll definitely use two, but I would go for iWidgets. And yes, that's Apex 2. It's free, so that should be great for you guys. Next up on this tweak list, guys, we have this one called Mitchua. I, I'm 100% I'm sure that I'm murdering this name. It's M-I-T-S-U-H-A. It's a little down below in the description guys don't worry about it and all it does it gives you a jello wave effect for the music application but currently it's not available with the ios 10 music application because ios 10 has changed and a lot of things but it definitely works in spotify so if you're a spotify fan this is the best tweak for you it looks really nice i really love it. it it just it has no options to configure whatsoever once you install the tweak and you play music it will take effect it's called Make sure definitely check this one out in Syria. When I take drugs, I go to the moon. 
Next up on this jailbreak list, guys, we have translucent messages. And this adds a stunning new look to your messages application. It makes your messages application translucent and blurred so that you could see the wallpaper of your springboard through it. And it's a complete revamp for the messages UI. Based on whatever wallpaper you have, it will reflect into the messages application and it gives it a nice blur. In addition to that, the tweak fully compatible with dark messages as well. So if you have dark messages enabled, it, it will work and you'll see the dark style blur it, it, it works really good with both tweaks so definitely if you're installing translucent messages make sure you install dark messages as well next up guys we have this old one what which was like from ios 8 i think it's called gravitation and it basically adds gravity to your home screen it's simple you just shake your device while you're on the home screen and all your icons will fall because of the gravity <laughs> so all you need to do is just tilt your device to move the icons around the tweak bounces and like it looks really cool that's all it does it, it doesn't add any functionality to your setup or anything but it looks really cool you could show your friends like hey you cannot do this i'm the cool kid around here so definitely check out gravitation it's not free you have to pay for this one all links will be down below in the description Next up guys we have smart tap which has been recently updated for iOS 10 so you could just turn on the screen by double tapping it it's pulled straight from android <laughs> i don't care though and you might be wondering why you need this tweak it's, i think it's just for the aesthetics you just double tap it, the only functionality i can see this bringing to your iphone is that if your power button is not working or if your hands are small and you own a 7 plus and you can't reach to the the side of the power button you can always double tap and that's all it does you can also use other gestures such as slide up from the bottom or slide down from the top of the screen while it's off and you can have it perform like different actions like unlock the device open the camera you could let it show notification center so definitely check this one out it's really cool it's called smart tap next up guys we have recent call plus this is literally one of my favorite tweaks on this um video right here and it lets you just make your call log more fun and usable it also adds the search functionality so the fun features it has is that it has icons to identify third party calling apps it can also have the country flags next to the country title it assigns emojis for different labels it can colorize your call log assign colors manually if you please or it has emojis as well so the useful features are you could search in your call log finding the necessary call entry that was never this easy before in ios 10 so definitely check out recent calls plus for all the fun and functional tweaks and yes guys that wraps up this video hope you enjoyed let's try and hit 200 likes on this video i'm positive we can do it and comment down below if you have any questions about the video or anything you see that you need to fix just hit me up on twitter I'll, I'll be right there now i'll be on this video for 30 minutes replying to comments so let me know anything you want to know and yes guys drop a like down below smash the like button let's aim for 200 likes and always guys remember this love peace and tweaks signing out